guys. Then show us your cocktail. Show us your cocktail! Sarah is joining us this morning from Oak and Ivy on Marco and Jeet's X1075. Um, she is not just a bartender there. She's got some other skills, including ice sculpting and things of this nature. She is multi-talented, very entertaining. And, and she knows how to wear the hell out of a dress, uh, too. Yes. Yes, a lot of people are into the dress. Very festive, very summery, very airy. It's kind of like uh, the, it's kind of like the it's Humane funny, Society. There's a lot of people, and there's no way to do it for me. No, 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 but you're on the Facebook Live, honey. You oh, gotta keep hi. Up with, you got to keep up with 2016. So <laughs> Yeah, wave at everybody. Say the, hi. What's the drink, Sarah, you say? It's something to do with essentially what scared me because a hundred, there are hundreds of tequilas and hundreds of everything. What All right. are we talking about? So this drink is a play on a classic called the 20th century. And it's made with a gin, the Le Blanc, a little bit of a white from the cacao, the chocolate liqueur, and a fresh lemon. Hold on, say that again. White what? I feel like you're speaking cacao. like French to me. My God. It's so foreign. It's all so foreign. <laughs> <laughs> but it's foreign to me, that's for sure. <laughs> all right, so... um. Are you, oh, you make one for yourself too, I hope, right? Hell yeah, I am. <laughs> this is great. Did you see the this slug is... she took when oh. she walked in the studio? She didn't come here to like it's, knit. It's quality control, man. Come on. <laughs> this is one of those drinks, uh, you know, it's got the tequila in it and, and this other stuff. You can't do this and then start going into other liquors, though, right? This is a commitment drink. No, you can totally do whatever you want. It's your life. <laughs> <laughs> Just called you out again. Yeah, you get a bartender like this chick, Uber is in your future. <laughs> Uber is definitely in your yes. future. <laughs> she does not mess around. You know what I love about uh, when we have people like Sarah on who like, uh, can trap like crazy fancy stuff? It's like there's so much that goes into these drinks that you don't think about, and then you have a sip of it, and you're like, perfection. You know, oh, thank you. Well, you, you haven't tried this yet, but... No, but I can tell. Now, Look at all the booze you got. I so. <laughs> smell it, though. The aroma's great. What am I smelling? A tequila, probably? All right, so what I'm, what I'm doing is actually a drink that's so easy, you could really do this at home and impress the hell out of your friends. It's a tequila, Casanoble Crystal Tequila. Okay. A little bit of Coqui Americano, which is this white wine aperitif. It's flavored with like over 13 different varieties of oranges from Italy. It's really, really beautiful. Nice and like dry. And then um, a little bit of homemade cinnamon syrup, which mm. I love making this stuff on the holidays. You just grab cinnamon powders, sticks, toast them up in a pot, add water and sugar to it, and you just let it go for like three hours. Man. Right. It's so yeah. easy. But that's I, what you're smelling. Sometimes I uh, snort cinnamon just to make funny faces. Oh, yeah? We should do the cinnamon challenge. I nominate Ransom doing it. Oh, that thing that broke the internet like 20 years ago? <laughs> I remember that. All right, a little quality control here. Quality control? Now, what is that? Okay, so that's a taste. You're just, there's a little taste. Oh, yeah. She said, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we might say, yeah, 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 good, or yeah, 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 I got to do some work. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna love this. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, yeah, it's a yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are about my, nothing right those now. Those are my kind of yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> She's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna have to call that Uber we talked about earlier. <laughs> oh, great. All right. <laughs> Leaving work in an Uber because I'm drunk. <laughs> I brought. Uh, I love that you kind of bought like uh, Scotch glasses with you. Dude, it feels real fancy. The fanciest this studio has ever felt. It's. Uh, we're kind of in an upper class here. Yeah, a little bit upper class. I'm I mean, spoiling guys. I mean, what you deserve is what you get. You get a small case of open ivy. So far, I like everything about it. It's high class. You got Scotch glasses. She's just loading up containers full of booze. Like, like it's her job to end booze. So she's yeah. like, we got to get rid of all of it. So I'm going to put it all in this cup. <laughs> Again, this is a show us your cocktail. Sarah from right. Oak and Ivy. Every Friday about 9 o'clock, we feature another local bar. Yeah, it's just, I love the local vibe. You get to meet people like Sarah. Yeah. And a place like uh, Container Park, you know, those are all locally owned business, locally, oper uh, locally operated businesses. It's a cool thing to have on. And we've got the shake. Let's Ready? do this. It's going down. All right. Right in the microphone so we can hear the shaking there. Okay. Oh, oh. Yeah! Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is a very shake weighted. Yeah. Very shake weighted. And again, I want to remind people to go to Marco and Jeeps on Facebook yes. and you can watch this live and check out the dress Sarah is wearing. And maybe she, the next time she shakes a drink. She's definitely getting a lot of thumbs up, guys. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of likes going on here. I gotta tell you though. Wait, are you getting ready to shake again? Heck yeah. Alright, hurry, go to Facebook. The smell of this is awesome. 
I mean, smells great. This is really the best view in the uh, in the in the in the studio. <laughs> Where you are? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, let's pour Jeets one real quick so he can get a uh, a little sample. Oh yeah. Okay. I want to see the face he makes because the face you made, Sarah, after you poured this was like, whoa. All right. You ready? I'm ready to go nuclear, Sarah. Okay. So. Send me. Finish, hold on. What's this? Touch here. I've got a little bit of Aztec chocolate bitters. It's a spray. It looks like a hairspray can. Yep, I'm going to mist it over the top. Oh it's my nice. God, I've never seen anything like that. All that cinnamon. I'm I can never it. drink another drink if you don't make it. It's a problem here. <laughs> I mean, as long as it's not hairspray, I'll drink it. <laughs> All right. you, you'll drink hairspray. Yeah, probably. Yeah, 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 it's so, fine. You know what I mean? You're drinking it. it. Oh my God. Okay, yeah. there's all kind of ransom. Look at so. that. Toasted cocoa bean, like, uh, nose on it. You enjoy Jesus. that? Now take a bite out of that chocolate. So I just gave him a piece of uh, Oaxacan chocolate that I got in Mexico the last time I was out there. I sprinkled it with a little bit of uh, paprika mm. and Oaxacan sea salt. Jesus. Right off I gotta the Sarah, i got to tell you, I mean, um, I've never seen anybody make a drink like that. I'm being very serious. I mean, this is it's like a very customized process that you're going through here. You Very like good. that? You know what? You know what's awesome when you take the mm. drink and then follow it with chocolate. Yeah, the taste combination does something crazy. It's really good. Yeah, back to shaking. Back to shaking. All right. Well, listen. We'll uh, we gotta take a break. You can keep making the drinks, but I wanted to say thank you. This is Sarah from Okanagan. This has been phenomenal. These people on uh, Facebook are going crazy as they as they should. And this is called. A blue century. She can go to uh, people blue can go to I and they go to uh, Oak and Ivy and get this awesome drink. From and once again, where do you want people to follow you? Uh, oh, and, and you know what? You this cocktail is actually a part of a competition series that I'm doing. So tacos and beer over on Paradise and Flamingo. They're doing a competition every Monday night in June. That's going to be from nine to eleven. Okay. You've got bartenders from all over the city coming in. And uh, everyone's welcome to come and join the fun and see what they do. I mean, you've got amazing, talented bartenders. So the, the joint's called Tacos and Beer? It's called Tacos and Beer. Okay. And it's uh, hosted, it's, sorry, it's sponsored by Casanova Tequila. All right. Mm. And, uh, Casanova. Wow. Yeah, every Monday, 9 to 11, and I will be there competing on the 27th, so the last Monday of the month. Well, let's get some fans out there, you know what I'm saying? Let's get and some it'll be this out. drink. So if you like the sound of it, You'll like the taste of it as well. I like the look of it. I like everything about it. All right, there's, uh, there's Sarah. You can check that out, like she said. And find her at Oak and Ivy. And show us your cocktail. It's Marco and G's X1075. All right. Great job, Sarah. Yeah, fantastic work. Good job. Thanks. Do you like it? I love it. Good. It's really good with that. Don't get me wrong. I still want my drink.